Two weeks ago, it claimed its first victim. The critically ill patients were treated in the intensive care unit. The infection was then diagnosed in other patients here. The infected have been quarantined at a unit set up in this hospital. Dedicated nurses in protective gear are treating the remaining patients. It spread, forcing authorities to shut down the ICU. But the exact source remains a mystery. Two of these patients died, but we cannot say that the death was directly linked to the infection with the Klebsiella producing this enzyme. In fact, there were seriously ill patients and they may have died of other causes. The bug first originated in New Delhi, India. It's found in the gastrointestine of humans. Ten cases have surfaced in Gauteng since September this year. The first was reported at the Sharak Makleke Hospital. The patient was discharged. Antibiotic resistance globally is of concern. What we certainly don't need is an organism that is becoming more and more difficult to treat in our South African hospitals. And for this reason we've taken in fact this situation extremely seriously. Experts have been roped in to contain the spread, but unhygienic practices are believed to compound the problem. Similar cases have also been reported in Europe, Canada and the US. Julian Pillay, SABC News, Benoni.